everyone. Welcome back to RVing TV. Thank you to you, our viewers. I'd like to start off by saying thank you for viewing the videos. If you like our videos, please click the like button and hit the subscribe. It'll give us access to more and more units. So thank you to you, our viewers. Today, we're gonna bring you something new. This is a 2023 Anthem 44D by Integra Coach. Now, the Anthem is the big brother to the Aspire. It's in the middle of the line of the big coaches. This is a 45 foot coach with tag axle sitting on a K2 chassis powered by a 450 horsepower Cummins engine also has the easy adjust uh, power steering assist and uh, is sitting on that K2 chassis, has 360 degree camera, has the large, a little hard to see here, but the large boxed awnings. There's two massive awnings that cover the entire coach, but really you wanna see the inside of this coach. So let's go and take a walk through it. First thing you'll notice is the beautifully finished stairs before you enter and the sliding floor to seal off the top. A nice little feature is they've put a storage drawer right here that you can use for a variety of items and keep them right at your fingertips. As we take a walk in, you'll see the beautiful leather wrapped handrail, assist rail for coming in. When you do come in, these seats are heated seats, fully power, nice extra wide well comfort for sitting. Now what I really like about this coach, uh, some of these here today had the digital screens off, so we're going to show you the Spartan Smart Wheel. So you have your basic functions to control your screen features, your washers, and your cruise control all here on the steering wheel. But we have an extra large screen with 360 degree view and all of our features are right in front of us. Temperature, transmission temperature, the PSI of our oil, uh, fuel that we have, our DEF, our batteries, the PSI of our both our front and our rear tanks for our air suspension. And then here to the side, we have a 15.2 inch media screen. So you can see it's showing here in the center for leveling, whether it's manual, whether you want to put it in travel mode or auto mode for leveling the coach itself. But you can work your way around. So not only do you have your backup camera here, but we have our 360 degree view camera, which is nice because a lot of coaches just have backup and side views. The 360 is coming out of the automotive market. And I'll bring it a little closer so you can see a little better. It's just a great little idea so you can see around you. Now, we have different features that you can go to by just pressing in our menu that goes around, right, our climate control set right there. We can actually operate our shades because in the Anthem, and we'll talk about it in the main living area, they are power shades. We have our basic controls for our mirrors in here for tilt defrost. We can set our GPS. Uh, as well as we have Bluetooth for our phone, we can operate our lights for inside the living area, our docking lights, our exterior lights. So it's a, just an overall nice layout, easy to use. Um, we can lock our cargo doors, we can lock our entry door here, set our house temperature. and just very straightforward and functional on a large screen. Push button start of course. Now as we spin around you're going to notice this is a very very spacious floor plan. We have ceramic tile floors here in the living area it's a heated floor. Nice large power recliners for your home theater seats. Right across is our fireplace and our big screen TV. And next to that is our wine fridge. So we can keep our wine nice and cold for entertaining or just for us to enjoy. Now the amount of countertop space is really great here because we have this space above our wine fridge that can be used. Great little coffee station 
uh, to put your espresso machine or your Keurig. Then we have a large galley with a pull-out island so that we get that extra space for prep. Of course, the cabinets are underlit, which is just a nice feature. We have dual induction range. Nice large double sink. There are sink toppers to go on top of that. And they're placed down in here with this pull out drawer where we have our garbage can and we can put our sink inserts there. So they're out of the way, they're safe, they're not being knocked over. There's also a Fisher and Paycal, oops, it's locked right now, a Fisher and Paycal dishwasher, our convection microwave oven with storage next to it. Now we've got a couple of compartments here. So we have, essentially I would call this a spice rack. Nice little spot to put your spices, your extra condiments that could be tucked aside. As we spin around, we have a beautifully elegant, nicely appointed dinette. And this looks like it does convert for sleeping if need be. And then storage above so that you get extra cabinetry right across. Large residential French style fridge. Now they have the fridges locked so normally I would show you but in this case unfortunately we can't. And next to it is a very large and deep pantry and you'll notice it's also lit which is a nice feature that it just adds that extra light. Now, before I move through the rest of the coach, as we pan up, you'll notice the nice recessed lighting and then our center light fixture that is fully surrounded in wood and just gives an elegant touch to our center ceiling without going over crazy with it. Now they use a residential style air conditioners. They're roof mounted still, but what you're going to see is in a few locations, intakes like this, there's another one up there, and then your outlets for your cool air, rather than having the air conditioner set in the center. What that does is it gives us the ceiling room to put a beautiful fixture like this, but also raises the air conditioners up higher and puts insulation from your compressors and your moving components that normally make noise in your living area. Those are not here because your intakes are here, so that gives you a quieter coach when those air conditioners are running. Now, as we look back, you'll notice it's very open to the back, but before we get there, we're going to talk about the multiplex system. They use the Vega Touch multiplex. Everything is right here at your fingertips. You can see our living, our kitchen, our bedroom area, even heated bay for our storage. Here's our floor heat. And here's our controls for our day and night shades. There's a master control as in the Anthem, they are power shades. And then this is going to be app based as well so you can get an app on your phone to be able to operate a lot of these functions whether it be your lights, your inverter, your generator, your automatic uh, generator start, all those functions will be here. Here's our lights and it illustrates the different areas of the coach. And here are our shades. We have our slide outs, our temperature controls. There's our solar panel as we have a solar panel on the roof. And it's just a nice overall way to see the coach. Gone are the days of all those cumbersome buttons. In the center, we have our half bath nicely appointed, good countertop space. And they are using the Tecma uh, macerating toilets. We have a window as well as we have really good storage in this half bath. Now the pocket doors are nice thick solid wood with raised panel inserts. We have 
pocket doors that are built into the wall rather than sitting on the outside of the wall. So just that little bit of extra attention to detail. We have a king size bed here with storage above, nicely appointed, nice trim on the walls. As we spin around, we have two large wardrobes and these are shelved wardrobes. Six drawers below are sound bar and TV here. So another large wardrobe with shelving. And then we move into the bath area, which is before our final storage. Super large corner shower, really nicely finished off with its own seat. We have another Tecma toilet here and then his and her sinks with drawers and extra storage for the bathroom. We also have three medicine cabinets. Hello everyone. And just overall a beautifully finished countertop. And yes, it is solid surface. As we make our way back to our rear storage closet, first thing you will notice is the rear wall is finished in cedar. Now this is done so that your clothes are always smelling fresh. You don't get any of that humidity kind of smell back here. So if you're spending a lot of time traveling, it really just finishes off the coach beautifully this way. Our hanging bar is lit, as you can see here. So it just gives that little bit of extra light in this closet. And then we have our stacking washer dryer, which again is a must for long trips. As we spin around, we have some shoe storage here, plus a lot of extra storage space down below. These are our carpets for up front in the coach. And then again, more storage with adjustable shelving and three more large drawers to put storage in. Now that we've taken a look at the inside of the coach, let's take a quick look outside at some of the features of this Anthem. Primarily, we want to look at the storage compartments to see what they're like, how much storage do they have? Do they have slide out trays? So let's take a little walk over. Now with the Anthem, as compared to its baby sister, the Aspire, you're gonna notice your paintwork carries over to your slide out. Now the slide outs are also a flush slide, meaning that they come inside the wall rather than overlapping on the wall that so many do. We are, or we, sorry, I apologize folks, I like to say we, Integra Coach is using a 365 70 by 22 and a half inch tire. That is a massive tire. It's going to give it a beautiful ride and really great road handling. Outside we have a large entertainment center, but you're going to notice this has a window awning package. So those are power awnings on the windows. So if you have a bright sunny day, you can put out that awning without closing up your shades. Just a beautiful, nice little touch to the coach itself. Now, as we look down, first thing you're gonna look for is a handle on your storage compartments. And there's no handle. What's nice with this is they have electronic locks. So from inside earlier in the video, if you noticed, I mentioned that you can lock these by the touch of a button. So simply push the button, it electronically pops it open. Now in our first bay, we have an easy glide tray with our Dometic freezer. So giving you that extra storage for long, long trips. We close that, we come to this bay, same thing, little push of a button, and you'll notice they light up green to tell you that they're open. We have a lined tray here that slides in and out either way, and on the Anthem, they are a full power tray, so we simply push the button on the door here, out comes our gear, and you'll notice that it actually comes out quite far. So I'm gonna take a little step back so you can actually see the length that it brings out the tray, making it super easy to get your gear. And this tray will slide out both ways. Simple push of a button and away goes your gear back into the coach. 
This is really about living the life of luxury. And that tray will support a thousand pounds of gear. Let's close up that compartment. Again, gentle push of a button, and we have an open bay, fully carpeted, nicely finished. Now I'm going to point out an, a feature. This is a K2 chassis by Spartan, and I hope you can see it here. We have our X brace. That X brace is used by Integra Coach, and that X brace is throughout this chassis. What it does is it actually strengthens and stiffens up the chassis so you get less roll and flex out of the chassis itself, giving you a better ride, giving you less flex on sidewalls, roof and floor. As we make our way down and we look at this bay, you're going to notice some fuses in here, but also a disconnect for our inverter. So if you put this coach in the storage, you can actually manually turn the inverter disconnect and it cuts power to that inverter so there's no parasitic draw on your batteries. There are docking lights on the outside. This is just gonna be where our holding tanks are. Now, for those of you that are new to RVing, this is a great place to put your holding tanks. Forward of your axles, it centralizes weight, provides stability. Up front, we're gonna have our large generator, so you're functioning on getting better balance out of your coach, which gives you a better driving experience. Then as we come around back, you're going to notice our engine bay and we're going to be a side mounted rad. Now we're not going to go around the other side, it's a little awkward at the show. Beautifully appointed lights with their accents and paint work in the LED accent. Let's take a little quick look as we walk down the coach so you can get an idea of the beauty, but the front cap as well is very well sculptured with LED accents. Uh, a little hard to see, but the Integra name is lit up here. We have LED accents around the lights, projector style lights, so just absolutely beautifully finished. So, if you're thinking you might like a luxury coach, want something well appointed, love the Integra brand, its, its features and its motto of without compromise, an Anthem may be a coach for you. Thank you to Integra Coach for giving us access to these coaches. Thank you to you, our viewers. If you like the video, please click the like button. If you uh, haven't subscribed, please subscribe. We're trying to push past the 10,000 subscriber mark. So we thank you for hitting that subscribe button. Bruno from RVing TV, I hope you've enjoyed the video and check back soon for more coaches by Integra Coach. Also, make sure you live life to the fullest each and every day. Take care.